Hi guys and welcome to the channel. I am Marv and this is Readies by Marvelous Madame Tarot. This is going to be your July 2024 number one energy read for the following nine zodiac signs that remain of Capricorn, Pisces, Aries, Gemini, Leo, Virgo, Scorpio, Sagittarius, and Aquarius. Everything that you need is below in the description box for you and your collective and in the pinned comments. As it stands now, Taurus, Cancer, and Libra is already uploaded and their extensions are up on the website. Now, this will be extended for purchase. So if you're interested in purchasing the extension, you can do that as well as book our new $35 summer special. If you're interested in connecting with me for a tarot reading or if you're interested in stopping by and purchasing any type of candles in my wax shop, you can do that and so much more at my website, www.marvelousmadame.com. All right, let's set the reading up. The reading is called Channeled Confessions and Revelations. I have channeled these confessions and revelations in an index card deck that I've created. I continue to add to that as, you know, the spirit so calls for. Um, but I will be um, tapping into the energy of you and your relationship or an individual that you are connected with. The way that the cards come out and the messages that come out, guys, will let us know the extent of the relationship. Please remember to take what resonates and leave the rest. All right. Once I've done that, I will close the, met the reading out with a Mystic Love Oracle cards. We I like to close them out with three. I will give you an entire message and let you know what this person external from you, regardless of the relationship status, is going through right now. All right. And if you're interested in, you know, furthering that message alone to see what else um, is uh, uncovered, I will be extending that for purchase. And at that point, we will be uncovering the following, how you feel about the situation, how they feel about the situation further, present energies and what actions, if any, they'll take. So I did not want to have to say that nine times. We're going to get through each and every one of the messages Thank you so much for listening to the intro and I will see you in your respective videos. Bye guys. Scorpio, you're up. What is this person confessing or revealing for Scorpio? The person that Scorpio clicked on this video for. Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Okay. Things are not as they seem with me. Well, I'm going to say to this revelation and or confession that you probably already knew that. You know why? Because you're a Scorpio. You already knew that. So this person doesn't feel comfortable with coming forward with what their truth is. And as the investigators of the Zodiac, you like to get down to the bottom and go get down in the DM with, with folks. So. You know, you feel that you don't run away from um, people and places or things that other people do. You have an, uh, an uncanny ability to be able to just to, to ride it out and hang in there. And you're just like, listen, like, what's the big secret? And so if you feel, although you are the kings and queens of secretive or... You, you may not like that word because that's your zodiac misconception <laughs> um, or your zodiac stereotype is like I, as I like to call them. You may not feel that that's necessarily the case and you know why you do the things that you do. And so you absolutely hate when people do the same thing because you feel like people should just keep it real. I mean, it goes both ways, but we ain't talking about you necessarily. This person is telling you things are not as they seem with me, by the way. I forgot to add that little with me part. What are they talking about here, spirit? What else do we need to know? Things are not as they seem with me. This person doesn't feel comfortable with letting you know some stuff. Um, as a result, they have put boundaries up. Okay. They put a whole lot of boundaries up. Queen of Swords is coming out. They put distance between you guys for a reason. 
Heart place shows the bond. Uh-oh. Are we having a person that doesn't feel comfortable with showing their feelings? Uh-oh. Two of cups. I don't quite know yet. I'm getting the hit. I'm not going to lie that this two of cups may be someone else that's in their heart place. I don't like what I'm seeing, Scorpio. This individual has things that they need to hide. And I did a similar reading for you guys where I told you in your um, quickie reading that this person was a low down toxic snake and you knew it. I hope this isn't a reincarnate of that energy because someone that you have recently connected with, I feel like this is new, um, has not been keeping it real. They carry a bond in their heart they have kept distance or put up distance between you and them to keep you furthest away from the truth as possible as in addition to keeping their options open knowing that the options that that all of these options are not viable they do this okay this is what they do interesting hmm Where's my clarifying deck? This person is in an energy of trying to keep you away from their truth. Things are not as they seem with me. They touted themselves or big up themselves or presented themselves as a person that was on the up and up. You were attracted to their no nonsense way of putting things. But they're still lying. Tell me about this two of cups. Okay. Them and another person is on a, on a break. Doubling down on this seven of swords energy. It's either that they're holding someone in their heart, Scorpio, or they, you guys connected on what you otherwise thought was a mutual bond. And it's, I don't, th this isn't right. Seven of cups and the main energy, seven of cups and the heart. Yep, they're juggling more than one person. Alimony, child support, something that they don't want you to know. They're financially obligated with this two of, of coins to another. Um, they're a part of another emotional bond. And they try to keep you as further away from that as possible if you are in an energy of trying to connect with them. This feels new, by the way. Yep, the chariot. Uh, you can't get close to this person because anytime they're going to nope out of here. I'm just telling you. Um, this person has an emotional connection and carrying something for someone else. Wow. You possibly are in the energy of wanting to get to know this person, Scorp. But they're not going to let you get to know them because they're going to keep that damn distance between you guys, as I've said. The reason why? They have to present this, this facade that they are keeping their options open. But they're not keeping their options open because they just don't want a commitment. They're keeping their options open or alleging that they're keeping their option open because they're already in a damn commitment. <laughs> That's why. Okay. That's why they're doing this. You could be connecting with water, fellow Cancer Pisces Scorpio, with a little effect of air. Okay. Air is here. Air is definitely here. Leo, Gemini, Aquarius. Strong cancer coming up, though. They could have just took a little break. Keeping options open, keeping options open is speaking to me. Did you meet this person on social, uh, or not social media? Well, I guess technically it is a form of social media. Did you meet this person, um, Scorpio, on a some type of dating app, dating site, whatever the hell it is? Things are not as what they say. Not things are not 
as they seem with me. Interesting. Interesting. Let's go ahead and get Mystic Love Oracle. I can't wait to unpack this one. Oh my goodness. We're going to be really minding their business, Scorpio. But you already know what it is. I just don't. Not all of it. Compromise and making changes. Some of them are reconciling with the ex that they have a bond with in their heart. They just took a break. Yep, legal matters. Some of them may even be getting a divorce from someone or they're legally separated, but they don't want to be divorced. There are legal disputes. Um, it, I do feel like this is an ex-spouse, but they still hold that person. They're still, did not tell you they were financially obligated to come. What are we talking about today? Spirit come through. Okay. Give me the last card. Give me the last card. We got divine intervention time for reflection. This person. And if I go one more down, just for shits and giggles, player strategic, this person, um, and if I go one more down after that, proposal, commitment. Yep, this is a previous situation. Scorpio, they're intrigued by you. Whatever you guys have done, which will hopefully come out in the extension, they cool with it. But they're lying. <laughs> they're, li they're a liar. You know, why not be, just keep it real about this? Why not just say it's OK um, that you want to keep your options open? You, you don't have a problem with that. You like truth. Keep it real with me. I don't want to be in the dark. I don't want to be the last one to know what the hell is going on in my life. I, I don't blame you, Scorpio. I don't like when people do me like that either. If that's how if that's who you are, that's who you're going to be. Ain't no circumstance or situation made you no way. You you came to the party like this. <laughs> I'm just saying. When I passed out the invitations, you was already a fool. Like you came to the party. That's how you was made. The, the, look, the situation didn't make you this way. This is how you made. The circumstances didn't make you like this. This is who you are. Hence why you're not even with this person no more. You're going through legal disputes. Because you're not an honest person. Yeah, they took a little social media break. But they're carrying a torch in their heart for somebody. Do you care? You probably degaff. Okay? You probably degaff, but that's not the point. Their confession and revelation is things are not as they seem with me. And that's where we're going to end it. Um, you met this person. They're keeping their options open. But what they're not revealing is so much more like they carry a torch and hold space for someone in their heart and they're lying about other things that they're going through that they have not told you now if you okay with that and you degaff that's cool okay however if you want to take it a step further please follow me in the extension scorpio we're going to be going and getting present energies that are external to this situation that may be influencing present energy influences basically we're going to go into how you feel, which I can't wait. Can't wait. We're going to go into how they feel. And we're going to also examine what actions they will take, if any, towards you in this situation. On these extensions, it gets real bald head, okay? Um, there is no politically correct. I'm saying what I'm saying is on my platform. My platform only has nothing to do with this platform, okay? Um, you do... Uh, go into this knowing that we keep it all the way a book over on my website. So if you want to join, you come over here and let me know how you rocking out with this extension to everybody else. We'll leave it right here. Thank you so much for allowing me to read for you. I appreciate this. And I'll see you in your next one, Scorpio. Bye, guys.